What's going on guys, Sean Gautier back with another video. You guys may be able to tell I got a new lighting set up for the photo area in the back of the barbershop. I actually already recorded this introduction and the camera was coming in and out of focus, so I had to come back and do it. And that was before we set everything up, but everything has been set up. You guys can see how good this lighting is and I'm still trying to learn it a little bit. But I wanted to show you guys the setup, what all comes with it. I'm gonna show you guys what I bought right here and the link is in the description. But sometimes guys, when I link things off of Amazon and you go to look, that item will not be on Amazon anymore. So just look at the picture. Make sure you guys search photo softbox light kit and look for the picture above if you want the same exact one. There are a whole bunch of other ones on Amazon. They're all around hundred bucks. But guys, I paid 90 for this setup. I'm gonna show you guys how I set it up and what all came with it in case you guys wanna grab one for yourself. All right guys, so this is the photo area. This is obviously just a white wall. And this black backdrop I bought on Amazon, so you guys can check it out. Just search black photo backdrop and you guys can find something similar. But let's see what's all in here. All right, one big bag, so let's go. These are the tripods or the uh, stands, I guess we would call them, but they're tripods. Alright, so a little bit cheap, guys, but the whole kit was only 80 bucks, so I did not expect too much. But this is basically going to be just like your ring light now. Why well, I can't get it to go out. There we go. So I know these box lights are pretty big, so we're going to want kind of a strong base here, but they're going to need to be pretty wide and then we can raise them up. And I'm going to probably not put the light way out from this stand just so it doesn't want to tip over all the time. Go ahead and tie this down, extend these out. Oh man, that's long. Alright, so these can go pretty tall, that's pretty nice. So I don't know how tall I'm going to put them, we're going to have to test this thing out, take a couple pictures with it, so we will see. Once we get the lights on there, how high we want. So I think these are the light bulbs and the box, whatever the bulb comes in. But yeah, there's a bulb right there. Oh man, let's check these things out. Some big old bulbs, that's the size of my head. Those are some big, uh, big light bulbs. So I guess this is gonna go in the box that's in the black bag, so. All right, we're just gonna put this on here. Power cord. All right, so you gotta push it in there like this and screw the bulb in. I don't know if I got it right. Oh, I'm right handed, guys. This ain't working. All right, before I put everything together, let's plug it in. See if it works. Yeah, we got light. So I'm guessing that this is the cover that goes over it. I don't really know how it goes on. Got some Velcro. Okay, we got some Velcro on the outside. Stick that. Nice little hexagon shape. These are all right, guys. I mean, they feel a little bit cheap, but uh, the whole kit was only 80 bucks, so, you know, how much more can you ask for? What do you know about it? There it is. So, for 80 bucks, guys, there's one. We'll go ahead and get the other one set up. Then we can test this thing out. So let's see what kind of light we got over here. Obviously the point is to have two and then basically with two you can do one brighter on the face and you can do one a little bit, you know, a little bit of a, a side light. So we'll do this one kind of, kind of like that. And you guys can see we get a nice light on this side. I can sit like this with my fade, a little shadow over here and you get some nice soft light, a little bit softer than the ring light. So the ring lights are super bright. Let's go ahead and pop that in. Now you guys can see, well, now I'm too tall. Let's see what that do. Yeah, so you guys can see the difference in the light. Just a little bit of a soft light on this side. Like I said, I can take a photo this way. Get the white backdrop, get a nice shot of the fade. 
But we can take some nice photos. So I gotta get this bulb working. Unfortunately, I just blew that thing and you know, just my luck, guys, stuff that happens. But anyway, when everybody gets here, I'm gonna try to get a few people to take some photos back here this morning and I'll get some clips of them actually taking photos back here and show you guys how it's working. So don't judge him, but yeah, it's gonna be solid. Boom! All right, y'all, my man, my man Markel, about to test out the setup. Yeah, I need some extension cords, but isn't that light so much better than the ring light light? Yeah, it's so much softer. Yeah, that's gonna be money. Okay. Yeah, so, it's all right. Yeah, well, I'm gonna actually go home and watch some like lighting tip nice. videos. Just look right into the light. <laughs> They're actually soft, like a lot softer than the ring lights were. Them things are. Yeah, I'm gonna get some cords because that's a little tight. Oh yeah, that's money. That one's a lot. That's crisp too. Yeah, and it's like perfectly lit. Let me see that. Ooh. Hey y'all, look at that, boy. That's what I'm talking about right That's there. fire. All right guys, so that is it for my photo lighting setup. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I think it turned out pretty dope, so I'm definitely still waiting to take some pictures with it, and I think it's gonna be next level. I might even grab a couple of these lights and put them on my station for my recordings. Those ring lights are just a little bit harsh, and sometimes it makes the skin look kind of washed out, so you guys can see these lights are super nice. And as far as I can tell, guys, the lighting looks pretty natural and nice and bright without being too much. But anyway, if you guys like this video, do me a favor, guys, smash that thumbs up. It helps the channel so much. Do me a favor and go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and turn on your bell notifications so you guys don't miss any content from me. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think of this light setup and if it's something you would consider getting for yourself. As always guys, I appreciate all of you that watch my channel and I'll catch you guys soon.